In today's video, I'm going to show you how to change the app icon and app name step by step in a Flutter application. And yes, it's way easier than you think. You ready? Let's go. First thing first, let's change the app icon. And for that purpose, let's create a new folder in the project's root directory called assets. Under that folder, let's add another folder called icon. Okay. And now let's drag and drop the icon in that folder. Okay. Icon has been added and I'm using an image of size 1024 by 1024. Next, we will add this Flutter Launcher Icons package to our Flutter project. For that purpose, let's go to Installing tab. Copy this command. Let's go to Visual Studio Code. Paste that command in the terminal. Hit Enter. This package is a super handy package which does all the resizing and configuration of icons for us. Next, let's open up pubspec.yaml file. And over here, we need to specify the icon details. Let's specify it below the dev dependencies like this and now let's go through this this configuration will be used to generate the app icons and over here we are specifying that we need to generate the app icons for android and ios and using the image path option we are specifying the icon path from the project's root directory and if you want to use different icon for android and ios then we can specify those details using the option image path for ios and image path for android okay for this demo we will be using the same icon for android and ios so we'll remove this section and now let's go to the terminal let's clear it first and here we need to execute one command dart run flutter underscore launcher underscore icons hit enter this command will automatically generate all the icon sizes that our app needs for Android and iOS. Easy, right? And we are also getting a message successfully generated launcher icons. Now let's go to the main dot dot and now let's run our application to see how it's looking. On iOS, our app icon is looking very good. But on Android, we see some white spacing around the app icon. And this is where the adaptive icons for Android comes in play. But what is adaptive icons and why we need them? So in different Android devices, you must have seen the app icons look different. On some devices, the app icons are in circular shape. On some devices, the app icons are in square shape with rounded corners. So to fix this, Android introduced adaptive icons in Android 8, that is API level 26. In this case, we have to specify our app icons in two layers. First one is the foreground layer which is a transparent PNG of our logo. And second one is the background layer where we can specify either a solid color or an image. So let's specify these details in our Flutter application. First, let's add the foreground and the background images in the icon folder. Let me grab those. Okay, put it in the icon folder. This is the foreground image and this is the background image. Both of these images are in the size of 432 by 432. Now let's go to the pubspec.yaml file and let's specify these details. Adaptive icon foreground. Okay. And the name is foreground image. And same for background. Okay. Hit save. Okay. Now let's go to the terminal. Let's clear it. And again, we have to execute the same command dart run flutter launcher underscore icons. Hit enter. And as we can see in the output, creating adaptive icons Android. Now let's run our application to see how it's looking. Our app icon is now looking good on Android as well as on iOS device. And if you want to make your app icon look even better on Android 13 and above devices with theme icon option, then go to Visual Studio Code. Let's add another image to our icon folder called monochrome image. Let me grab that, put it in the icon folder. This image is of size 432 by 432. Now let's go to pubspec.yaml file. Let's specify the details of the monochrome image. 
एडेप्टिव आइकन मोनोक्रोम एंड वी हैव टू स्पेसिफाई दी पाथ फॉर अवर मोनोक्रोम इमेज फ्रॉम दी रूट डिरेक्टरी प्रोजेक्ट्स रूट डिरेक्टरी मोनोक्रोम इट सेव गो टू टर्मिनल लेट स्टॉप द डिबगिंग एंड वी हैव टू अगेन एग्जीक्यूट दी सेम कमांड डार्ट रन लटर अंडर स्कोर लॉन्चर अंडर स्कोर आइकन्स इट एंटर and as we can see in the output creating adaptive monochrome icon android now let's go to main dot dart and let's run our application to see how it's looking on android 13 and above devices so this is how our app icon will look on android 13 and above devices with theme icon option enable and there is no change in the app icon for ios and if i go to the setting change the color go back to the home screen as we can see the icon color changes now let's see how to change the app name to change the app name for android let's go to android app src main and let's open up android manifest.xml and over here we have to add our desired app name let's call it as shopping app save and for ios let's go to ios runner and open up info.plist and over here we have to change this cf bundle display name it's already shopping app so we are good now let's run our application to see how it's looking and as we can see our app name has changed both on android as well as on ios and that's it now our flutter application has a brand new icon and a proper name i hope you found this video helpful hit like and subscribe for more awesome flutter content until next time keep coding keep learning and i will see you in the next video happy coding